Hi, this is Edger Joe, and in this video I'm going to show you how to insert and delete columns and rows. So if we look back to our previous work that we've done, you can see that we've got two cells, uh, sorry, two columns over here that we may or may not need uh, one or both of them. So let's say I decide, okay, I don't want to have uh, the column B, then to delete it, I can just go right there, use the, uh, the arrow that becomes uh, like the black down arrow, I right click on it and I go delete and that will delete the cell and you will see it'll, uh, the, it will keep the shape of the other cell that has been resized before and it will just put it in that place. Also notice that the B doesn't disappear, it just replaces the, the previous C uh, and so on so that the spreadsheet retains its shape in terms of letters and numbers. It's the same with um, the numbers over here. Let's say there's two rows at the top and I want to delete row one. I just go onto the number, uh, yeah, onto the number one, right click, press delete, and then that is gone. If I want to insert cells, uh, rows or columns, it works exactly the same way. I can just go on that same row, right click, and then go insert. It'll put it in and also notice that the number stays the same. And let's say I decide to, I don't know, put in a, a another column over there, I right click, insert, and then I have a column over there. Now I'm just going to undo that one, so it's back the way it was. It also works with multiple cells, so if I decide, hang on, I need to insert something on the left here, then I can highlight, for example, three of those columns, right click on top of it, and go insert, and it'll push everything across, keeping the default size uh, for um, the different columns and in the same way you can do that for your uh, uh, rows so I just right click on that and say insert and it does exactly the same thing so uh, in terms of deleting just like before you can also delete uh, multiple um, columns and rows at a time and uh, I just want to delete that as well so I can have it back to where we are so that is how you can insert and delete um, rows and columns thank you thank you for watching